and just like that, as quickly as we left, we're back. Uh, I just kind of wanted to cut it straight just to get the video out, uh, but we're back. We defeated the goblin and we leveled up to level 3 for everybody. If you're curious about what the leveling process was, uh, I invite you to look at the last video, uh, which kind of explained it all in much more details. Now, being level 3 means we can learn these spells. Do we have enough gold? We, ha we have enough gold. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to learn this, which was Rave Enfeeblement. And I'm going to learn uh, Detect Thought, which is going to be 100 gold because it's a level 2 spells. <gasps> and basically how much it costs for you to learn the spells is 50 gold per spell level. <gasps> Sorry, kind of the... Kind of that. Uh, so... Absolute Bane, but I know the Absolute, um, but it's only if we have like the Absolute's mark on our flesh, so I'll see if I ever get that, but um, for the time being, we're not going to use it uh, right now. However, we do have a lot of things, and I'm going to look if it would be possible for us to sell some of it to the campus member. Um, because we do have a lot of it. Um, so I'm just looking around, uh, to see if everybody has the right armor. I think they do. Hmm. But this is disadvantage on stealth check. But you're not the one who's going to be stealthing around. So I think that's a good trade. Um, but yeah, regardless. Let's go. Also, just, just in case, I'm kind of curious. I'm going to remove one of my prepared spells, right? Um, actually, I'm going to remove all of them. Except Mage Armor. I'm going to equip the Tech Dot. Because this is going to be... Um, this is going to be kind of a more chill day. Um, so what else? What what else do we equip? I guess we equip chromatic orb. Can't hurt. Um, magic missiles and disguise cells maybe. If we try to uh, sneak around. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk out of view of most people so I don't know how they'll take to me um, to me doing that also what like how do I make sure how, how do I make sure it's ritual casting is this ritual casting like if I was to cast this so th it, it it clearly does highlight that it's gonna use this uh, a, a spell level, but this doesn't, so I'm assuming the ritual is gonna work. Yeah. Perfect. So whenever you're not in a fight, it's gonna detect stuff. So this is concentration. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna... I'm, I'm, I just saved them. I'm not gonna, like, disguise self, but we can walk around a little bit and see if we can detect some thoughts. Aradin's back with his tail between his legs. I'm glad for your help, but I'd hoped you were Halsin. Halsin? Sorry to disappoint. Hells, I didn't mean it that way. Halsin's important, but you're the first bit of good faith we've had since he left. Keep your wits about you. Things are tense with the druids here. So seemingly, the tech tots doesn't do much for us. Also... I'm gonna cast my level 1 spell. Uh, I'm gonna Mage Armor. Because... Did I not do it earlier? Maybe I didn't do it earlier. I'm unsure. Alright. Alright, let's go talk to Zara, to uh, Zevlor. And then let's explore the camp. Sell a little bit of our stuff. And then uh, let's go find the, the goblins. Right? Forgive that display. Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. I wouldn't have looked to a drow for help, but I'm grateful all the same. 
I'm Zevlor. I take my tanks and coins. I could go this way. Um, maybe. Well met. Maybe. I should warn you. Visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. That's fair. Goblin got you. The druid Halsin's a renowned healer, but he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Nettie. She's with the other druids in the inner grove. I mean, They've it is a serious, ritual but... To cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. What brought you here? We're refugees from Elturel. We took shelter here after Knowles attacked us on the road. We were bound for Baldur's Gate, and it was too late to turn back. Elturel had no place for tieflings after the descent. The descent? An infernal conspiracy that had seen the entire city of Elturel briefly dragged to the hells. Whoops. Okay, I'm not gonna be blatantly racist to them. Holy shit. <laughs> Maybe no, maybe you people should have stayed in hell. Are you kidding me? If you people survive that, they'll survive anything. So I hoped, but we've lost so many already. And more will die if we're forced out again. The ritual is there no way to convince the druid to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You though. I know it's not your business. But she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. What are you offering for my aid? We owe you a great debt. What little we have, we'll scrape together. It isn't coin we need, it's time. Hmm. I'll see what I can really? do. Really? We're messengers now. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense. Oh, and if it's of any concern, you're brave to walk around without hiding your heritage. I'll make sure everyone knows that you helped us at the gate. A hat! So I have Detectots on, but I don't- I- I haven't seen anything... I haven't seen anything good out of it yet, but... We'll see. Refugees, adventurers, and even a drow. No one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. What are Just you selling? Some bobs I no longer need. All right. So, oh, dark vision. That's cool. So he has a bunch of scrolls that I'm gonna be able to get for sure. Um, all right. So I'm just gonna sell him. I'm just gonna sell him a bunch of things I don't need. Maybe I still need that. We don't even know these people. That doesn't matter. Of course it does. You would choose strangers over us. That's not what I said. Can we stop shouting? No? I'm just gonna drop a few things I don't think I'm gonna need. The onyx, the plate, the like all of these things don't really matter to me. Um, what really matters to me is these things to make sure I can I can I can transcribe the things. Um, 
and my scroll. So I'm gonna offer you this. And then I'm gonna try to take Calm scrolls. Down. Please. Um I won't leave them behind. So You're he has kill. Cloud of Dagger. Scroll of Fetterfall, Enfeeblement, Magic Missiles. Dark Vision, Crown of Manus, and Flaming Sphere, though, very uncommon. Very, very uncommon. Um, like, that doesn't work, right? I think Crown of Manus can wait. What happens if I do this? Okay, okay still too expensive. Should have known, should have known, should have known, should have known. Basically tried to sell all of my crap to him. Uh, which one is more important? I already have Dark Vision, so I don't even know what I'm trying to do, right? Sylvanas, guide your path. Take that back. True. I'm gonna send everything to me <clears throat> because I think I'll be able to sell them fairly well. Now you're keeping this. But we can sell that one, right? Then what about you? Well met. Is there anything you need? I, just some bits and bobs I no longer does. need. You would choose strangers over us. That's not what I said. Can we stop shouting? No? Like, that's a pretty good offer. I already know fire... Fire, burning hands, right? I think. He has so much good stuff. Do I feel like I'm gonna be able to take his stuff whenever I kill him with the druids? I really hope. Calm I really down. hope. Alright. Pleasure doing so business with you, my friend. Alright. Okay, so what about you guys? Oh no. Aw, oh, crap. I'll not get I didn't mean to go with Shadowheart. Futures on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Roland's right, sis. We should leave while we still can. Or would you deny your brother here his chance at fortune in Baldur's Gate? Ah, uh, fine. Let's sneak away like God's damned cowards. But if something happens to these people, it's on us. I hope you know that. Whoops. No one stopped me yet. I mean, Best I'm gonna kill life. everyone, so they might as well leave. It's gonna be easier for me to kill, to, to rampage and slaughter everyone here. Very well. We've known enough grief this 10 day traveler. Don't be the cause of more. Okay, that's a weird thing to just say to someone, but sure, whatever you want, brother. Alright, so Burning Sphere. I don't have enough gold to learn. That's fine. Does anybody have gold that they're hoarding from me? Nay. I'm the only one with gold. Alright, we're gonna figure something out. Swift as my feet can carry me. Damn, goblins! 
Oh, I. I was just gonna let it fall off, stick it in my satchel. I ain't letting anyone here near me. They all sat and watched while Zevlor near got us killed. Oh, very gracious of you. We expected a soft job. Something to test the new lad, maybe, but not a bloody goblin nest. The goblins. Most would have turned tail at the sight, but not Liam, no. He charged him. Dumbass. <laughs> bastard. All right. I'm guessing that didn't end well. So you just left your phone to the goblin or he died and with bravery, you should be proud. Uh. No. He must have thought we were following. Always the optimist was Liam. Hope they cut him down quick before he saw we were gone. Whoops. More mercies. Good to be back behind the walls, have to say. For as long as that lasts. <laughs> what a dumbass. Don't make me hurt you, boy. Too late! Looking at you is painful enough. If it ain't the friendly drow. Thought you were with the goblins when you showed up at the gate. Glad you weren't. You fight well. Not like them bloody tieflings. I could use some help. Is there a healer here? Yeah, I don't. I don't want to make friend with these people. I just want to do You're my thing. Elson, druid who runs this place, knew his stuff, but he ain't here anymore. Think he's got an apprentice running around somewhere, though. Nadine, Natalie, something like that. We've got a contract to track down some relic, and he wanted in on the job. Eyes lit up when he heard about it. Didn't work out, though. Goblins got him when we were turning tail. He's either digging latrines or boiling in a cook pot by now. Fair. Um, can I have a look at the contract? Job's all yours, if you got a death wish. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that'll pay gobloads for a relic supposedly buried round these parts. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Just tell me where to find it. It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you the map and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own todger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. It'll show you where we turn back. If you feel like dying. Okay. So. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Boulder's Gate when you die. Okay, so we need to find Brian. And then Brian is gonna be able to tell us. Well, well he's not gonna be able to tell us, but he's gonna have... Mm the map of where the night song is and whenever we find a night song that's when we can uh get on with the quest all right that's fair enough you saw you fighting those slimy bastards fancy a bowl best to fill your belly now while we still can suit yourself but the only way we'll make it to Baldur's Gate is to run, and run hard. If a null catches your scent, you'll need every bit of strength. Trust me. Eh, I'll be fine. Off bad. So, Auntie Ethel. What? Really ready. <laughs> Anti Ethel, okay. And then Otka. So I know Ethel is from the early access. Oh, isn't the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you But I didn't think she was here. Oh There isn't a bit of colour in those cheeks, Petal. Are you harsh? Cold? Feverish? Auntie Ethel will search you out. I've lotions and potions galore. Bother. Portion of invisibility of invince an invisibility, my god. Okay, and she has a bunch of stuff, 
big bush. Okay, so yeah, I'm not gonna say who she is because obviously, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna say who she is because obviously, it's a little bit out there. Care, but no, sweetie, Don't yeah. you lie to me, boy. I know you have it. Touch me and I'll bite your fingers off. I will. Goblins, druids. This grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. All right, we'll do. Shoes. Where are my boots? You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. Doesn't even matter if you kill me. I'm chosen by the absolute I am. I'm blessed. <laughs> Here it comes, you little beast. All right. What was behind here? Seems simple enough. I mean, no one's. No one's watching, right? Huh. So I could go all the way around and steal their stuff. But I think I'm going to wait. I think I'm going to wait a bit. What's that? Oh, you can go here. Oh. Something over there. Oh, and there's a stone door. So, can I jump? Yeah, I can. Hop. <laughs> oh no. Did I even get anything by coming here? Bet I didn't even get anything for coming here. Can I still cast Detect Thought as a ritual? Yeah. I don't think it took anything. Alright, so I guess I'm just gonna go back. So what's up with the stone door? <laughs> Goblins. Shut it. Boss is rip you for talking now. Rune of the bear. Well, at least we got the druid. The garden the statue. <laughs> Glowing eyes are rarely a good sign. Best be careful. Okay. Wake him up by chopping off the tongue. That'd be funny. 
Yeah, give him something to cry about. Don't wear his voice out. We still need answers. Quick save, for sure. We'll get the druid talking. Grove's got to be full of magic. That's why I've been stabbing all the rats. Might be spies. One step at a time. Ah! <laughs> Just like old times. Sometimes the only way out is through. Ignis! So the guardian statue statue has its Swift own turn. Carry me. <laughs> I guess since I don't want the statue to hurt me. Oh, and it attacks the enemies as well. Rough. Time for a new approach. Rough. Ooh. <laughs> ah! Run! Immune? Oh no, that's bad. Just like old times. Step carefully. Okay, if I come here, are you gonna hurt me? Oh, he's dead? Okay, so you're deactivated and wasn't there another one right here? There's a bird one here. Okay, well, you're deactivated. So technically, in theory, if I run around, I should be completely fine. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I like that he he's dead. I should speak up. Breaths are shallow, Whew. his wounds deep. He doesn't respond to your voice. Do we kill? How much farther can I go? I remember usually he was normal. What to do? <clears throat> Okay, so the eagle was right there. The hell catch a break. Traps. How considerate. These boots have seen everything. Don't touch me. All right. 
What now? Did she have guidance? She does. Got to keep moving. Like, there's no way this fails, right? Yeah, it's like it adds ten. All right, so it's disarmed, and now we can lock it once again. Very low chance of this failing because we add like 10. Yeah. Jesus, that's so good. Such a good roll. Alright. What does it give me? Fly trap. Chance to ignare chance to ensnare the target if, it, if it's not a plant or a beast. So it doesn't give really give me anything because I'm never gonna use it to kind of like fight. But I appreciate it existing for sure. That's some pretty good loot. On my way. All right, not gonna lie, I don't know what to do with him. Mm. His breaths are shallow. Oh, it's just a hat. All right, cool. In her name. And these things have stayed interesting. Yeah, gonna be honest, I didn't really want to like take care of him or anything. I didn't really care all that much. Not gonna lie. Which, hey, might be mean, but also, uh, who cares, right? Who cares? Stone door. Step carefully. That's a trap. Poison cloud vent. Well, hello. I mean, we can. We can. Not, we cannot. All right, um, and like, what am I supposed to do here? I'm not seeing anything here. Alright, I'm just gonna leave, I think. I think I'm just gonna leave, you know? What is behind stone door number three? That might be worth a look. 
Okay. Yeah, yeah, that might be worth a look, huh, Liesl? Do you think? You think? Okay, where the, where the hell am I? All right. So I was here. We need to find Zoru, and he's right there. So I think. Oh, didn't mean to. I, I didn't think if I clicked on it like that easily it would teleport me all the way, but I'll take it honestly. Why does this keep happening? He was joking about Octa Soup just a moment ago. Come on, bring me home. Now what? We dig a hole and be done with him. Killing is good. It calls the weak. We could say a prayer. But theft would be paid for painfully, a thousand times over. Yeah. All right, so we looked at a bunch of things. Where is Zoru? If I just walk this way, I'm gonna find him. All right, cool. The survivors, not soldiers. I failed to see the distinction. You have something to ask. Your entire body is a weapon. Move along. Okay. Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Yeah, you're like five. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Hey there, can I have a word? I guess I want well to insult the guy in front of him. The blade of frontiers at your but the man's smile bends downward and his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers, racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe. Okay. Hell. Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Who was that woman in the, the one in your thoughts? You saw her then. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship. But the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now. Preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Isn't Karlak one of the companion we can join? We can have with us? Um, if you have a Mind Flayer tadpole in your head, doesn't that worry you? I'd be a fool if it didn't. I know the stories. Doomed to shed my skin. Become a lithid. And there's no coming back. But I haven't sprouted any tentacles. Least not yet, thank Baldurin. Could just be good luck. But sooner or later, it's bound to run out. There's no need for us to get with him. He's gonna leave the moment we side with the goblins, so we're just gonna leave. Swing and swing and Take your time. Oh. <sighs> Zoru! By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you?
Lower. <laughs> You dare interrupt? Has the tadpole ravaged your senses? Yeah, shut the, shut the hell up a little bit. Let's just get to the point. On the road to Baldur's Gate, near the mountain pass, S saw us for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. Whoops. And I just... I just... ran. The map. Show me. Yes. Your mediocre interrogation technique notwithstanding. Up. You can keep your innards. Alright, we got the information. What's up, Donnie? Mm. He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. You see nothing out of the ordinary. When you turn back, there's no trace of the child. Oh, he stole stuff from us. I I wonder why the tech thoughts doesn't help me in this situation, right? Like, that kind of sucks. Oh! Hey! You're one of those drow, right? I heard stories about you. How you all live underground and steal kids away. <laughs> Nonsense, we kill far more children than oh. we enslave. Okay. Um... Hey, would you like to see something fun? Go on, take this ring. It's lucky. You haven't seen anything yet, mister. Go on, take the ring and watch your fortune change. Why? I could roll again, but now nah, I'm gonna roll for it. I'm gonna roll with it. Hard luck, mister. But like I said, we can change that. Watch. Call it. Heads or tails. Tails it is! See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheat, too. Interested? That's a nice trick. Um... Hey, not so loud. You caught me. All right. They're not lucky rings. I'm just trying to earn money for my family. My father left and my mother. She's so sick. Cool. I wish I had better things to sell than trinkets but it's all i have thank you that means so much that's what i got The ring of being really invisible. The ring of resistance to ants. Ring of infinite wishes, bruh. But he does have cheap supplies. And he has a book. Red dye, light blue dye. Okay, and he has dye. Um, not gonna get anything from him. Maybe once Nothing he dies, you. but... 
you suddenly feel something moving against your back and turn. Read the tech thoughts. The first time we can use it. Let's go. Ooh, you're screwed now. You see her hand in your bags and the shame in her heart. They <laughs> lunge at her. I can't do this anymore, Mattis. I'm sorry. Uh, hey, are you here to trade or? Yeah, I know. I was standing right here telling her to rob you. Hey, you're not taking any slaves here. Look, you caught her. Good for you. You aren't a chump like everyone else around her. Now, do me a favor. Make room for the chumps. I mean, I can respect the hustle, I guess. Please, last room. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Ragrashab, or I'll rip your damn throat out. <gasps> Raw, the bear. Magrin, give him a chance. You step back. We'll not tolerate drow in here. Kind of rude. What's so special it's down there? It's forbidden to outsiders. Kaga's orders. Ooh, Kaga's order. I guess we're not gonna go for it then. Another step, and Magrim will tear you open like a sack of grain. Keep back. Force my hand, and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Why would she allow one of them? I... I suppose so. <laughs> you. I really wanted to chance Apparently, it. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. I really Go wanted to chance you. it. Holy. One wrong move and every single animal here will tear you apart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure, for okay, sure, for sure. Alright, we're gonna save the game. Oh, Volo. What's up, Volo? Do my eyes to save me. A drow! Here! Forgive my surprise. It's rare to find your kind above ground. Rare and intriguing on a day already packed with intrigue. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. <laughs> Nah, I guess we'll, we'll humor him. Now then, how would you <clears throat> describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities? You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Goblins were of a rare gem-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. What? <laughs> a myth weaver. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? The truth, my friend. Not a jot more or less. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Ooh, the absolute. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh curious. Curious, curious indeed. indeed. I've interrogated one. 
a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Never you mind. I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. <laughs> the guy's just gonna go there. Um... I'm just gonna leave him, go to the camp. I'm gonna talk to him later on, maybe, depending on how it goes. Madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? Fair. I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. We will speak soon enough. First, judgment must be passed. The parasite eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. Okay. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Read Koga's mind. Let's go. Detect thoughts activated. Detect thoughts not activated. Oh, roll again. Screw it. I don't care. Roll again. Let's go. Yeah! We got it! Halsin is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. That's fair. Now, Rath. No. Imagine the snake just kills her. Ha! <laughs> Tila to me. I mean, child, you you had it coming. What can I say? Gone. By the gods, Koga, what have you done? Bury the remains. Continue the right. And the parents? They're just outside. Eh, outside who cares? We'll take word once I've spoken to him. We must focus on the right. She's there. Child, Koga, we are guardians, Let's get not in and killers. Out of this place before bear your tears. To bear their she knew the us. danger. She still tried to run. The longer we stay here, the closer we come to reaching the same fate. Shadowheart was frightened? Oh, because she hates wolves. She hates wolves, that's right. That's right, that's if right, that's right. If only we'd right, never let right. the tieflings in, the child might have lived. A deep elf. In our grove, on this day. A sign. Or rather, a gift. Who better to understand a watchful broodmother than a beloved child of Loth? Fair. You protected your own without hesitation. My compliment. Then we agree. Preservation is not luxury. It is not zealotry. It is necessity. Yeah. A viper bears her fangs defending her brood. Is it not her nature to strike at invaders? I took back the idol of Sylvanus. And the rite has resumed. We will seal the grove. Free from harm. Free of intruders.
This right must be born of powerful magic. The right of thorns. It is the Tree Father's gift that none come to harm. When we speak the final prayer, the great vine will sprout forth. The grove mm. will be cloaked in bramble and thorn. No one enters, no one leaves. Sanctuary. Sanctuary. None of this can like happen while well, outlanders infect us. Sylvanus demands that we choke them out. Fair. Do what you want, it's none of my concern. Then I was wise to grant you entry. And you'd be wise to heed my words. I want you to provide your services to Sevlor. Offer to guide the outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the viper must strike. Prattle hold you want, the refugees aren't my concern. Then they soon know the sting of my venom. Get out. We have no more business. Alright, I must go talk to Nettie first. Which is you. I see you. Just give me a moment. This may be There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what? Trial. Last time I saw one of you folk, he tried to slit me open. I hope you're more agreeable. <laughs> um, depends on how good of a healer how you. Ah! To tell, there's nothing obviously wrong with you. A bit tired, maybe. But we're all a bit tired. I'm not gonna tell her right away. And get some rest. There's no better magic. Take a nip of whiskey before bed if you need to. <laughs> Come back to me if that doesn't do it. That's the trick. That's the trick. Of course. No blue leaf sap. And? Feeling any better? Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Crawled in? Some sort of bug? Or... Wait, did it look like a tadpole? But from your worst nightmare? <laughs> All slime, teeth and tentacles? That's... a serious condition. Come, follow me. So I in the early access... In the early access, she tries to kill us. We need us. to be quick. Um, this way seen stealing. Resolving this peacefully will require more caution than you displayed in getting caught. You've won leniency, but lost... Yeah, I didn't mean to click on that. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna quick save. Um... There's something in that vessel. Don't worry about him on the table. I'm not in the habit of killing drow. Yeah. He attacked Master Halson and I in the woods, leading a pack of goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Mm. He and I have the same Seems parasite. So. Give Master Halson a right start. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. I pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. You don't have to be here for this. Please, don't mind me. <laughs> I'll just watch. All right. Let's see what we can do. What's that plant with his she help? She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Mm. 
Something's off. Detect thoughts, please. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? I'm telling you everything you need to know. Believe me on that. I want mm, to she help is you, sus. But I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? Oh, uh, I mean, yeah, kind of. Um, I can merge my mind with anyone else that's Victims expected. can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. On a mind flayer ship, I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flayer ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform, I mean, no, you can. We're all dead. You can clearly kill me if I transform here. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. All right, hand it over. Swear it. I thought you could cure me. What about that branch of yours? The thorn? Coated in a fatal toxin. It was a last resort, in case I couldn't trust you. I don't have a cure. Only a Okay. I'm sorry for misleading you, but I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, <sighs> do I have your word or not? I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Dozens? Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flares out there. Hmm. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. That is odd. You must have learned something from studying them. For one, that thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from mind flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. You said you were tracking other victims. Did they change? Hard to say, but there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. Hmm. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. You think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. That's if fair. If you can find Halston and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Sounds like you're making a lot of assumptions that could kill me. The way I see it, you have two options. Halson, or that wyvern poison. I don't envy your choice, truly. But this is the hand fate's dealt you. Fair. Alright, I'll you. find him. It would mean everything to the Grove. To I mean, me. I'm not gonna I find him, right? More. I'm just telling her But only so those I can leave. adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. 
And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. All right, I'm gonna get out of here, and then I'm gonna tell the parents of the child that was killed, obviously, and then I'm Better gonna leave. Becoming a mind player. Keep it in case things start to go very wrong. Alas. I've never learned to converse with your kind. Can I talk to the parents? Yes, I'm quite aware. Unless you have news of Arabella, I don't want to hear it. Oh. Please. Is our yeah, this is right? none of my concern. I haven't involved myself too much already, no more. Then piss off! Alright, see ya nerds. See ya nerds. A. A. Goodbye. Uh, did I go here? I don't remember. I don't think I went in there. But oh yeah, this is um Zevlor's room, right? The war room. Uh, do I want to go in there? I think I just want to go to the goblins. Yeah, I think I'll call this an episode. We explored the grove quite thoroughly, and next episode I'm going to go to the goblins talk to them and see what happens so i'll see you guys then thank you guys for watching and yeah i'll see you guys next time for the goblin the goblin episode finally where we're gonna side with them uh so yeah goodbye and i'll see you guys very soon